Lunchtime is always a busy period for John Oringa. He manages the Wawa restaurant in the heart of Uganda's capital, Kampala. And he knows how to attract customers. They spend money on food. Each and every person, you must eat food and you will be happy. If you don't eat food, you can't be happy and you will not work. Many Ugandans like these restaurants, which often have their favorite foods on the menu. Oxtail is one of the popular sauces here, served with plantain, sweet potatoes and rice. This would cost you about $3. The vegetable sauces are cheaper and customers say these are affordable meals. Joseph Omala is a regular here. He loves the food, but he enjoys the prices even more. I don't think really for here I would cut down because this is almost the cheapest food around. If you look at the uh, prices in the market today, things have gone so high up. So when you look at 10,000, fair, 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 fair charge here. Joseph is one of many Ugandans who are struggling through a cost of living crisis here. High food and fuel prices are eating into the weekly budgets of families across the country. Many have decided to reduce the expenses by looking at cheaper meal options. For this kind of arrangement, I don't think I would need to cut down on anything, but uh, probably would save some luxuries um, so that we can push over and enjoy during the festivities. As the days tick down to the holiday season, the excitement is building. Here in the center of Kampala, consumers are eager to cash in on the end of year sales. But experts feel transactions are much fewer than usual. For Ringa, there will be little or nothing at all to cash in. Actually, toward December, always the have reduced because majority of people goes up country. And the that's why even us, towards Christmas time, we go for holiday. We close for some two weeks. But before that, it is about keeping customers happy ahead of a season when many will be mindful about their spend on travel, drink and recreation.